Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for October 29th, 2020. So today we have What Do You Need to Release? Waning Moon. And as soon as I can get this to cooperate, I will happily pull a cabochon, okay? <laughs> I don't want to give up on the little setup though. Here, you know what we need for the shot though? We need a bat. Hold on. Let me, let me get this thing off the wall. Boom. Comment down below if anybody was like, hey, you need one right there, like right there. It was driving you nuts that I wasn't doing it. Okay, anyway, so it's there now. <laughs> what do you need to release Winnie Moon? If you were getting frustrated because there was a blank spot right there and you're like, why don't you take care of that? Maybe you should look at that. Okay, no, honestly, I would be doing the same thing. But <laughs> we were talking yesterday about the emotional body and, you know, it being time Maybe it's time to release this idea of, I need the external things to be in a place of what I call normal before I can be happy. I need things to be going my way before I can be happy. Maybe it's time to release that, okay? If you have anger towards somebody, I'm gonna go ahead and get the cabbage on for us. If you have anger towards somebody, and every, especially if you're losing sleep over it, and every morning you wake up and it's the first thing you're thinking of, maybe it's time to release that as well. All right, what is our cabochon for today? All right, there's the Lacta paper. I don't know if you can see that, but it's, oh, there you go. It's so, so, so beautiful. I love this paper. Anyway, this is Archangel. Hi, okay, I swear I'll get this right. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Archangel Uriel. So today we're talking about wisdom and strength. Okay, this is solar plexus. This is understanding your power through your wisdom. So how many of us have, you know, we felt our purpose, we're expressing our purpose, and we look at somebody who's kind of, you know, they're just kind of quiet and serene. You're like, you know what? <laughs> where, you know, where, where do you get off just being peaceful? Like, what's that about? And really, I think what the Archangel Uriel uh, message here is with what do you need to release? Uh, part of that might be not everything has to be a fight. Not everything has to be action. Although Archangel Uriel can let you know when it is time to go into action. Okay. This is also about setting boundaries. Archangel Uriel, again, solar plexus. A lot of people associate Archangel Michael as well with that area. This is knowing when to speak your truth and when to back up and just let somebody do their thing. <laughs> right? This is where it's time to say, no, I'm setting a boundary. I'm not going to be, you know, participating in this anymore. I'm not going to pretend like everything's okay when it's not, you know, it's that sort of thing. Knowing when to take action and knowing when to just let things play out. This is also a bit of wisdom and understanding about where your self-esteem issues might come from, whether you have inflated self-esteem are you always trying to convince everybody that you're worth something? You need to look at that. Or you don't have much self-esteem. Or you have self, a good self-esteem, but whew, in this world, man, at every turn, someone's trying to knock you down. That's the sort of thing an Archangel Uriel can help you with, kind of understanding how to ebb and flow with the energies that flow through each of us. And how can we foster more cooperation? So when we talk about what do you need to release, what do you need to release in order to get into that happier place? All right. So we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you all so much love and take care. Bye-bye.